Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 with yours truly, Lord of the Mad. Hi, Lord of the Flows, Sorry, Mr. Spiffening. Level 22, Boxes Man, and get this back in 2013 and all around neutral guy. Now let's speak with Sims again. Got my eye on you. Don't do anything stupid. Not planning to. I'm looking for my father, a middle aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. Is it that? Oh yeah, there is. Hmm. Let's discuss this bomb. What about it? Uh, don't you think someone should disarm that thing? I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? You think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? I can see about disarming that bomb for you. Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it first. Go easy. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. That's better than nothing. Hmm. Alright, then take a look at it. Great. Go ahead and see what you can do. Just be careful. Hmm. Alright, uh... Know anything about the area outside Megaton? It's called the Wasteland for a reason. But there are settlements too spread all around. The human race is stubborn like that. Let me out. To the south you've got Rivet City. But don't bother going to DC. Place is a war zone. Right. Tell me about your town. What do you want to know? Does the town have a doctor? Yep, he's a bit cranky, but he means well. Just make sure there's something actually wrong with you before you bother him. You'll find him down in the plaza at the bottom of the hill, across the way from the brass lantern. Know where I can find a drink? Get a drink, even. Sure. Head over to Moriarty's for spirits, or if you want something to eat, head over to the Brass Lantern. All right, let's talk about something else. All right, shoot. Hmm. I could do some directions around town, I guess. Sure thing, partner. What do you need to find? Love. I mean, where's the closest clinic? Our clinic is down in the crater, by the bomb. Doc Church is a little rough around the edges. But the man's got talent and compassion. Is there a weapon stealer around here? You'll probably want to see Moira at Craterside Supply. She sells some weapons. Makes some too, from what I hear. Her place is down by the crater. Cool. Is there a power in town? Sure is. Moriarty's. The entrance is on the top level, opposite the main gate. Just be careful. Moriarty is not your friend, no matter what he may say. So don't fall for his lies. And for God's sake, don't trust the man. Hmm. I need some equipment. Where's the nearest general store? Moira sells all kinds of stuff at her place. Crater side supply. Take a guess where it is. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's talk about something else. Sure thing. What's on your mind? Hmm. Uh, nothing for now. I have to go now. Bye. Mind your manners now. I'm going to shoot everyone in your city. I mean, um, I'm going to go and look at the bomb. Yeah, that's what I meant. Oh, that's the clinic. Hello. You're looking to trade, stranger? Check out Craterside Supply. Here's another settler. Who are you? Jenny Stahl. Now, I know I've never seen you in Megaton before. Well, let me guess. Just passing through, right? We get people trying to settle down here all the time. Anyway, if you're hungry, you came to the right place. What can I get you? I'm looking for my father, a middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. Oh, man, you're looking for your dad? That is so sweet. Did he run out on you when you were a kid or something? Our parents died when we were kids. My brother Leo, he's the oldest. He raised my brother Andy and me. It was hard on him, but we turned out okay. But God, you don't want to hear about that. I'm sorry, but I haven't seen your dad. He didn't eat at the Brass Lantern. I'd remember if he did. Um, how do you expect... Ugh. 
he, he didn't even ask me to describe the man. She assumed that he ran out on me when I was a kid. And... What? <laughs> this is kind of silly. This is kind of silly. As far as she knows, Seamus might be my father, you know? Oh. What can you tell me about Megaton? Some people hate this place. But I guess that's their right. But what the hell do they want out of life? Food, shelter, and safety. Works for me. Yeah. What's the word around town? I ain't heard much, truth be told. I don't really ever leave the lantern. Too much work. Too few hours in the day, you know? Yeah. Okay, I have to go now. Bye. Remember us if you need something. I wonder if I could boys. have sold some water to her. Men, women. Jenny? So what's it going to be? What's on the menu? Have a look. Most of it's edible. Some of it even tastes good. Really? No. Fascinating. Um, what? How much are you willing to offer me for some of this, um, you know, purified water, for example? That's a good thing, right? And of course, no diner is safe without some scotch. You need some scotch to fend off the scots. Wait, that makes no sense. To distract them, maybe. I have some vodka as well, I'm going to write it. Get your people drunk. Oh, now I need to find something I can sell for free. Is there anything I can sell for that for little monies? Oh, but maybe she has something good. Like steam packs. Score. Oh, now I have to pay her. So let's see what else I can get rid of. I'm gonna keep the sniper rifle for now because it's pretty damn good actually. Do I... I don't use this thingies. Don't know if there's any sense in collecting them. Hmm. Alright, now no 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 no. I still need to balance the monies out. Uh, let's skip it. And that's the done right? Enjoy. I have to go now. Come back. How much stuff I can carry now? A lot. Come Good. forth. To gather and behold the power of Adam. Let's investigate the tale of this bomb. The bomb appears inert, but further examination reveals that it is still operational and still quite dangerous. With the right gear, it would be trivial to rig it to explode. To disarm the bomb, however, would take a highly skilled explosive ex expert. Attempt to disarm the bomb. You have successfully disarmed the bomb. But I'm not an explosives expert. Attend now to the words of the prophet of Atom. Um the water's radioactive, you know. Forth and drink the waters of the glow. For this ancient weapon of war is our salvation. It is the very symbol of Atom's glory. Right. Let it Who have we here? Could it be? A new addition to our humble little community? Dear child, welcome. Welcome to Megaton. Thanks for having me. I am Confessor Cromwell, prophet of Atom and father of the Undying Glow. Please, child, come to the church anytime, anytime at all. Your bomb is kind of ruined. Sorry, I'm looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. Many of the transient visitors end up at one of Megaton's seedier establishments. I suggest you speak to Colin Moriarty and continue your search there. Oh, well, thank you. Tell me about the Church of Adam. Yes, what would you like to know? What do you believe? The Church of the Children of Adam is based on the idea that each single atomic mass in all of creation contains within it an entire universe. When that atomic mass is split, a single universe divides and becomes two, thus signifying the single greatest act of Atom's creation. Occasionally, a divine event occurs, and trillions upon trillions of new universes are created. The last such event took place here 200 years ago. 
where most of the lost children of Atom see that event as simple war and devastation, we see creation and unification in Atom's glow. Uh-huh. Why do you worship the bomb? Those who were called to Atom during the Great Division were very fortunate. They were permitted to aid in the process of Atom's creation. We seek the same, both in symbol and in fact. And the bomb, as you call it, represents Atom's capacity for creation. We kneel before it and ask that Atom call us to aid him. We pray that out of our meager bodies, he will create new life. Mm. <laughs> Is that really something I want to ask them? <laughs> no, I don't, really. As you wish. Their religion is their religion. I don't... It's not my... My business. Okay. Confessor, have you ever traveled outside of Megaton? In my youth, I traveled quite a bit. But that was a different life. I assume that you are seeking information and advice, yes? The only advice that I can offer is this. You will find no wealth in the wasteland greater than that which you will find within yourself. Bask in Atom's glow and you will understand. Oh god, the radiation has made him poop gold. Awesome. Okay, um, what's the news? News? My friend, I take effort not to be involved in such worldly business. Earthly pursuits distract from Atom. Of course, now that you mentioned it, I've noticed that Moira has hired a mercenary to protect her goods. The man never sleeps, so they say. Oh, that's actually really interesting. I have to go now. Bye. I wish you well on your path. Actually, I want to know more about Megaton. Tell me about it Megaton. It is so good to see you again, dear child. Remember, the Church of the Children of Atom is always here for you. Salvation is attainable. Mm, that's nice. What can you tell me about Megaton? Megaton. Atom's sacred village. He has chosen this place for the site of his shrine, and we have been called. Outsiders ask us, why did you build a town around a bomb? To them I say, the bomb brings the promise of division and the gift of the glow. The bomb is us. The bomb is Atom. And thus, we are Atom, awaiting the day in which each of us gives birth to a trillion new lives. Great. I have to go now. Rays shower you, child. Um, yes. I don't want to get radioactive. Hello. Radioactive. Hey there. Hello. I'll be damned. You did it, didn't you? You disarmed that thing. Here's your reward. Hell, why don't you move in? Could use someone like you. Got an empty place here you can use. Here's the key indeed. Woo, I have it ain't home. much to look at, but talk with Moira. She's got random odds and ends you might be able to spruce the place up with. So this means I am no longer homeless. Maybe. Go away, Windows Live thingy. Oh, and I also leveled up. What do I want to do with that? Um, I was at some point actually tempted to go with fully small guns, but I have more energy weapons now than I did before. So... First off, uh, this is a science and repair level. That's all there is to this. Continue. Now, um, let me just uh, investigate what the, is, these things actually do. I'll go with comprehension. Because I currently have a book and a bronchi. And you know, it kind of sounds useful to actually be able to double the bonus from these books. Because the number of books in this world is limited. Now where the hell is my home? I'm gonna go home. I'm no longer homeless, which is cool. Being homeless was fun while it lasted, but hey. I don't need to be homeless. And you are... Walter. Um, huh? Yeah, what is it? Hello, Walter. 
What can I do to help around here? Well, it's no secret that the old water treatment plant is on its last legs. And I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. Now, I don't expect much from strangers. But if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks. I can do that. How many leaks are there? From the pressure in the plant, my guess is that there are three of them scattered around town. Check along the pipes and the valves, but they might be a bit tricky to spot. Alright, um, I'll keep that in mind. I hope you can help. If folks knew how bad it was getting up here, well, I don't know what would happen. Uh, what can you tell me about Megaton? What can I tell you about Megaton? Well, that fucking bomb is killing us all slowly. How's that for a piece of information? Hmm, maybe it doesn't seem to be radioactive outside the water. What do you do around here? I take care of the water purification plant. That old rusted hunk keeps us in clean water. For now. Alright, and what's the word around town? Is it bird? Well, people have been saying that the water purifier is about to go. Honestly, I'll tell you what I tell them. I've been keeping that wreck going for 35 years, and this is the first time I've ever had a problem I couldn't fix. Um, do you need any help inside the plant at some point? Well, back to work. Hmm. This is the water processing plant. Alright, I'll try to find the piping issues then. I assume they are, are around down. Ah, oh, there, there's one. Hello. Attempt to fix it. Yay. Alright, so I need to fix two more. Who's here? <gasps> My Megaton house. Hello, home. Hello, Wadsworth. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wadsworth, your personal robotic butler. I always wanted one. I am here to look after your needs and to keep you happy and entertained. Can you do a dance? What can I do for you? Can you dance? Tell me a joke. Two atoms are in a bar. One says, I think I lost an electron. The other says, are you sure? To which the other replies, I'm positive. That's a classic. Tell me a joke. My humor emitter array requires recharging. Oh. <sighs> Alright, I have to go now. If there's anything you require further, feel free to ask, sir. You might get a haircut. Except uh, the other hair options that, uh, you know, I liked were really, 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 really shiny. Did they have more? Oh, I had medicine and I had uh, lockpicking, didn't I? That was all. That was all. I have some lockers here. <gasps> I have a fridge and there's food in it. And I have metal cooking pots and pans <gasps> and plates of various colors and the tin can and the spatula. I always wanted the spatula. And uh, uh, this one doesn't have much. And I have a sink. And, and there's an upstairs portion. That's worth. Can we decorate this place, Wadsworth? I think we can if we talk to Moira. And we have a desk with some grounds in it. This is exactly where I like to keep my ammo. How did they know? And there's a room up here with nothing in it. Yes! I'm so hyped. So hyped to have my own home. No longer homeless. <laughs> Okay, now um, what I want, what I want, what I want is to fix more leaks. Uh, that's Sherika's house. Why am I going this high when I'm looking for leaks? There probably are no pipes here. Hello, Nathan. Ah, look at this! New blood! Tell me, boy, you ever hear of the Enclave? The last remnant of the good old USA they are. Now, I don't know you from Adam. But I got you pegged for a Patriot, and any Patriot worth his salt is gonna toss his gun in for the Enclave. Any day now, they're gonna roll up here, and then this nightmare will be over for good. But listen to me, Ramble. I'm Nathan. What can I do for you? 
The Enclave. Is that how it's pronounced? Oh, keep forgetting. Uh, if you've never seen the Enclave, how can you know anything about them? They're on the radio. They have been for years. President Eden talks about everything they're doing. They got flying robots all around, watching everything so they know what to do when they finally swoop in and clean this place up. You'll see. People think I'm just a crazy old man. Things will be different when the Enclave gets here. I met the Enclave. At least a soldier of them. There's... I kinda killed him with a car. Why do you support the Enclave? Why? Why? Look around you! This is the good old USA! Sure, she looks a little bit different these days, but you're still on American soil. And even if you were born in some underground vault, you were born under the United States, which makes you an American. And it's your duty, and my duty, to support our country and our president, no matter what. Understand? Are you kidding? It's the duty of a citizen to question his government. Why, that's unthinkable! Where in the Constitution does it say that we're supposed to run around questioning the government? Huh? Hmm. Well, they did give us guns and say, if you fuck up, feel free to take us out. Well, when you put it that way, way. You're just trying to confuse me with your fancy vault education and your textbooks. I'll have none of it. Did you have something else you wanted to ask, or were you done with your crazy talk? No, yeah, well, there's so much crazy, more crazy talk to have. Who are the Enclave anyway? They're the American government. The Eagle. People come Weaver. The more perfect union. All right. What's the word around town? I couldn't tell you, really. I talked to Manya if you care that much. She's lived in Megaton longer than anyone. Oh, thank you. I have to go now. Take care. Oh, so thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.